No, I think, um, listen, I, I don't, I'm not saying this that I want to see anybody play poorly, um, but I really do believe that when you're a freshman and you're as talented as he is, and for most of your high school career, there was probably very few times that you really struggle. And clearly when you step on the floor, you're the best player on the floor. And now you get to this level and you're playing at Ohio State and you're playing at Syracuse and you're playing at Rutgers and you're playing at Florida State and, and Texas A. You know, there's a different level of talent that he's dealing with right now. And I really think that for him, him going through what he went through last game and what he went through from Rutgers, he has to go through that in order to take the next step as a player, to understand the speed and pace of the game, to understand that he's got to play out of his comfort zone a little bit um, in terms of the speed of the game. Um, him going through the process of coming from high school to college and how different it is, I just think there's a real, real learning curve there for him. And I don't think he's any different than any really talented freshman. I mean, I remember when Mike Miller came here, first game he had like 25 points and 10 rebounds, and then he goes to Florida State the next game, and he's got like four points and six turnovers. You know, there's just he's, – he's having to go through this process. And I have confidence in him. And the thing that I try to explain to him is that he's got to focus on the things that he can really control. I was more – I was really, really pleased in the game with him last game because I felt like in some games previously – He'd get down on himself. He'd hold himself to too high of a standard, and he needs to be easier on himself. What I was more disappointed in this game was his lack of rebounding, and he's been such a good rebounder. I think he had zero or one rebound in the game. I was really proud of the fact that he kind of was, I could tell he was working through missing layups, two for 15. And I think when you go through some of those things, it, it really forces you to look at, okay, how do I get better? And really. The main goal right now is I got to do other things to help our team win. Well, game. I think the one thing that stands out to me is just, uh, uh, you know, our, our turnovers, averaging eight turn, 18 turnovers a game, and then, you know, looking at our schedule as a whole and being a team that's, you know, leading the league in assists to turnover ratio, number of assists. Um, I think that's hurt us, um, you know, averaging 18 a game. I think that's something that we got to do a better job at. Um, and we'll need to do a better job in, in, uh, in Knoxville. Um, I also think um, our ability to make really good decisions, and I don't necessarily mean turning the ball over, but making good decisions of when to shoot, when not to shoot, when to go inside, when to play, you know, all that stuff of our team being on the same page, I think that's got to get better too.